So hello, welcome. Uh, this is uh, a town, UK Towns blog, and I am in Gloucester. This is a historic port. Uh, well, I say port. It's an inland port uh, with a historic dock, which has now been turned mostly into housing, uh, which is to my left. So we'll have a look round. There is actually a lot of things here. There's a priory, there's a cathedral. There is actually a Beatrix Potter house where they wrote one of their stories, uh, which is here. We'll go and see if we can find that. And then there's also a market mall um, and mart, which I could do, uh, which is at uh, Gloucester Keys. Now you have to be careful with this because there is a uh, white line there which you can just see it is a step and I didn't see it just now I nearly went over it I have uh, a town Oops. Blimey I should have done that So we have to go all the way down to the end So the Soldiers of Gloucester Museum, there's a uh, museum here that celebrates the soldiers, the famous uh, Gloucester Regiment uh, Museum and it's now named Back Badge Square in honour of the unique privilege granted to the Gloucester Regiment following their heroic action at the Battle of Alexandria in 1801. So you can see that there is uh, Ledger craft here as well, so there's canal barges and things like that. So it's all very typical of a uh, regenerated dockland area. This is, this is the, um, the museum over here, so there is a uh, soldiers of Gloucestershire. There's a ramp as well. I've forgotten how much it is, I did look it up. I think it's um, I'm not going to guess anyway. I'll, I'll put a note down on the um, bottom. Tell you how much it is.
is the area around the Mariner's Chapel, which is in front of us, once frequented by seamen from many nations. Uh, obviously coming to say a prayer and the, um, the uh, chaplain welcomed uh, all seamen regardless of where they came from and uh, <laughs> yes so there we go that's the uh, chapel and the square itself there so let's head uh, carry on round I don't think we're going to, I don't think we'll be able to get in there, it's a bit narrow. But there is a, um, you could get in there if the other door was open, but, um, yeah, I'm not going to go in. National Waterways Museum, ahead, over, well, over the way there. So that's that, there's, uh, yeah, more warehouses. So we head this way, this looks like uh, being the uh, Gloucester Keys. Gloucester Keys of Mal, which is uh, quite large. Somewhere over here, really. Over to my right, there's a cafe on the barge. Cafe on the cup. I've got to get this here, we This is interesting. This uh, apparently there's two wagons that mark the route of Gloucester's first railway project, opened in 1811 with a horse-drawn tram road connecting the docks with Cheltenham and then in 1848 the Midland Railway opened a main line to the docks passing to the left near Albion Cottages which is over that way so and then six, six years later the Great Western opened a broad gauge on the west side of the canal. It's a very interesting structure. The sailor. So we're down into the Southgate area, Southgate, Westgate, Northgate. Um, so we'll cross the road and head into town. See, uh, see if we can get one over. City Museum, Art Gallery, Bus and Railway Station and Cathedral. Much like any other town or city. like most of it is pedestrianised. Ah, uh, Blackfriars Priory is off down here. So we'll have a look at that first. Gloucester Blackfriars was founded in 1239 for the Dominican Friars 
often called black fires because of the colour of their habits and it's a um, includes the magnificent 13th century roof timbers. It was closed in 1539 during Henry VIII's dissolution of the monasteries so he basically got rid of all the uh, churches and uh, monasteries. It's open uh, 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. I'm not sure that um, you would be able to go in there because of the there's a, a very big sort of um, cobbled steps here and it is uh, actually the run by the English heritage so you would be able to go in free if you remember right so carrying on down the uh, Main Street. I don't read uh, Latin, I have no idea. Let's have a look around the side. This is uh, about, about Roman, Roman Gloucester. So it was actually Saxon followed by Roman. The uh, AD 180 by the look of it, the Roman city. So this is uh, Eastgate, Gloucester, Eastgate Street, uh, or whatever you want to call it. So it's uh, very, very um, pedestrianised. There is a shop mobility to my right, somewhere down here. somewhere down here. So Museum of Gloucester just there. This uh, mural depicts all the uh, aspects of history, uh, all the way through. Another mall. Oh, King's Walk. King's Walk Mall. So. Yes, 
things that no. I've got to do something about that pavement. The cathedral is free to go in, however, um, they ask for a donation of five pounds. And also they charge three pounds for photo photographing. like a little alleyway. Church.
pronounce it. Okay, so that's the end of today's visit to Gloucester. Bye for now.